Hi, my name is Ken Wells. Today I'd like to talk to you about your online reputation score. You've probably never heard of that before, but it's really going to have a, an impact on the amount of phone calls that your company receives. So up till now you had to fight for your ranking, which you're still going to have to do, but now you're also going to have to fight for your reputation score. So let me explain how this works. Every time somebody uses your product or service, they have an opportunity to go to the internet and post a review about your company. And you're gonna see this more and more. So your customers can post a review on Google, or Yahoo, Bing, they can go to City Search, Yellow Pages, Yelp, and the list just goes on and on. And what Google does is they take all these reviews, they compile them, and then they come up with a reputation score for your company. So their scores are based on 30, other search engines are based on five, and it really depends on the search engine. So what I'm gonna to do today is I'm gonna base everything on a five-star rating because everybody understands that. Five-star means that you have a great reputation. One-star means that you have a not-so-great reputation. And if you don't have any stars, it means that you're just not rated. In other words, you don't have any reviews. So let's look at a typical scenario. So put yourself in your prospect's shoes just for a second. You search online for a product or service that's similar to yours, and let's say you look at the first three listings. So the top listing has a three-star reputation. So three out of five, that's not so bad. So let's say the second listing that you're looking at has no stars, so in other words, they don't have any reviews yet. And let's say the third listing has a five-star reputation. So the question really comes down to this. Who is it that you're going to call, right? Who is it that your prospects are gonna call? Are they going to call the three-star rating? Probably not, right? They're always gonna call the five-star rating. Are they gonna call the, the company that has no rating, right, like because they don't have any reviews? Probably not. So even if you're on the top of the list, it doesn't mean that you're going to get the majority of business. It's the company on the first page with the best reputation score that will. So if you're in the number one spot right now and your reputation is not that great, all you're really doing is promoting the fact that you don't have a great reputation. But not to worry. So what I'd like to do, what I'd like you to do right now is to find out exactly what your online reputation score is. There's a form just below this video. Enter in your details in about one minute, you're gonna get a custom report that's going to display any bad reviews that are posted online about your company. They'll also tell you what your reputation score is. And along with your custom report, there is also another video there that'll give you some advice on improving your reputation score and also on how to get more five-star reviews. So take a minute now and fill out the form below.